on a stick here, we have 8-11, uh, crossbred male, um, all white male. I think he's got a little bit of blue dots right there above his eyes. Um, shaggy, uh, really good in terms of just how we like to build them around here. But this will be a 8-11 uh, daylight in-game uh, commotion. Commotion uh, be the champion Yorkshire Guild in fifth overall guild. There are a few beers back uh, there at the Illinois State Fair. So um, in-game on the bottom side, daylight on the top side, 8-11. Well, we've seen uh, quite a few of these eights, and they, they, they're different shapes and sizes, but, man, are they good. Uh, and this 8-11 right here, this is kind of one of those because he don't have a lot of color on him. And, you know, he, again, just kind of one of them chunky-bodied ones uh, that uh, doesn't like to just cock off or Eric out here all the time. Once you set in and just say, hey, I'm looking for a pig to feed, and uh, he doesn't have to just look absolutely maxed out today, but I need one that's going to feed for the long haul. We always get them questions. I mean, what's the top end? What's the top end? And a guy, these guys here, I mean, I guarantee you that uh, if they're feeding for their own kid or they're feeding for their, their niece or whoever it may be, uh, they're, they're going to probably have this pig down on their short list. But also at the same time, challenging whenever you got all them colored up ones back there that are so tricked out looking. If I'm buying, this is the kind of pig that I'm looking for right here because to me, uh, is he going to set the sale in terms of standard uh, of simple price? Probably not. But I will tell you right now that that one's got his elite uh, and have an opportunity and shot to win something as any we've seen come through. That's a real neat pig. Yeah, I wish this hog would just want to show off uh, because he is tough built. Um, and, man, when he does actually just want to get his head up and just uh, uh, collect his posture, uh, this hog's very neat in terms of his proportions. His upper hips long, his body line short, and man, he is stout headed and big armed. Uh, this is one I'm guessing Miles is going to try and sneak out of the sale. Uh, <laughs> this one should find friends, though. If you come through the set, uh, I wouldn't doubt uh, uh, this pig here at Dash 11 looks like the kind uh, uh, that's going to find friends for, you know, for Expo, for Louisville, wherever it may be. Uh, like I talked earlier on a couple of these, these blue hogs, man, you got to be dense if you're going to play in the big rings. Uh, these things are dense. And this one here, uh, for as dense as he is, I think is very appropriate. And it's just his step and the depth to his heel, the way his top line sits on his cage. Man, he's bulky. Uh, got a really good kind of center cage and center body. Very good show Barry here offered.